Okay, I'll show you this first. Um, I just Googled myself Clive Worth. And uh, about two years ago, I'd done a, a video about eBay, but my book's been on eBay. And I just seen this now, eBay with Clive Worth, pick up with men skill. So I clicked on it, okay? And um, it's loading up now. Here it is. Pick up with men skill, okay? And it comes down. Here's my video. eBay with Clive Worth. And then I come down here then. And um, I see another book here. Dating Handbook. The Average Guys Dating Handbook. Uh, I don't mind doing a video about this. It's about dating, the same as my book. In fact, I got four books out about dating on Amazon as well as eBay. But the difference is that a lot of these dating books are made by professional people, women, men, who themselves have not experienced a lot of dates like I have. Now the reason I did a, a book, well four books now, is because I made headlines in the media for dating too many women on a, a popular dating site in the UK and was kicked off because of it. Because these women were complaining that I was using them and that I lacked commitment. I made world news, I was in all the papers, magazines all over the world. And I've done a few documentaries since then. You can see the clips of those documentaries on my profile on YouTube, or just Google me. And then I was asked to do a book. I had no intentions of doing a book. I didn't think I could do a book. But it came to me naturally when I started doing the book and uh, putting down all the dates I'd had not just in the UK, all over the world. I was having with men all over the world come here. I say come here because I live in uh, West Wales and uh, all these women were coming to see me. Yeah, I was bluffing them, wasn't I? I was making out that I had plenty of money and all that and I owned a yacht and holiday homes and they were willing to travel from all over the world to see this wealthy guy. And I put a young picture of me on and, and of course they were all turning up and uh, Stay with me, and then I was kicking them out. So my stories in my book are all genuine and true stories. But this book now, there's no doubt about it. It's selling well because the two beautiful women on the front, uh, the heading, the average guy's dating handbook, the heading is is good as well. So it's going to sell, but it's not done by somebody who's experienced dating like I have. And a lot of books like this sell well because of the way these professional authors and writers put it across. Now, I'm not a professional. In fact, the publisher named my first book and I had a part of naming my second book that I've in paperback, but the, the third and fourth book are Kindle books. But you can also get my first and second book in Kindle. So I thought I'd do a video about this to uh, let people know who are buying dating books that if you do buy a date book, dating book, make sure you're buying it by somebody who's actually writing the two stories and genuinely giving you, you know, uh, tips and how he had a lot of women and so forth, like I do. But, but you know, there's no taking away from it that uh, these professional writers, they're good. And i got to say, this cover is really good, you know. I wish I could get a cover like this on my book. In fact, what I'll do, I'll... I'll uh, send this up to my publisher 
and uh, you see if he wants me to do a, a fifth book or maybe he'll put this cover or something like this on one of my books because this is what sells you see beautiful women this is what sells anyway I'll end now and put this on YouTube okay okay I'll show you this first um, I just googled myself Clive Worth and uh, about two years ago I'd done a, a video about eBay but my book's been on eBay and I just seen this now eBay with Clive Worth pick up with men skill so I clicked on it okay and um, it's loading up now here it is pick up with men skill okay and it comes down here's my video eBay with Clive Worth and then I come down here then and um, I see another book here dating handbook the average guy's dating handbook uh, I don't mind doing a video about this it's about dating the same as my book in fact I got four books out about dating on Amazon as well as eBay but the difference is that a lot of these dating books are made by professional people women men who themselves have not experienced a lot of dates like I have now the reason I did a, a book well four books now is because I made headlines in the media for dating too many women on a, a popular dating site in the UK and I was kicked off because of it because these women were complaining that I was using them and that I lacked commitment I made world news I was in all the papers magazines all over the world and I've done a few documentaries since then you can see the clips of those documentaries on my profile on YouTube or just Google me and then I was asked to do a book I had no intentions of doing a book I didn't think I could do a book but it came to me naturally when I started doing the book and uh, putting down all the dates I'd had not just in the UK all over the world I was having with men all over the world come here I say come here because I live in uh, West Wales and uh, all these women were coming to see me yeah I was bluffing them I was making out that plenty of money and all that and I owned a yacht and holiday homes and they were willing to travel from all over the world to see this wealthy guy and I put a young picture of me on and, and of course they were all turning up and uh, staying with me and then I was kicking them out so my stories in my book are all genuine and true stories but this book now there's no doubt about it it's selling well because the two beautiful women on the front um, the heading the average guy's dating handbook heading is, is good as well so it's going to sell but it's not done by somebody who's experienced dating like I have and a lot of books like this sell well because of the way these professional authors and writers put it across now I'm not a professional in fact the publisher named my first book and I had a part of naming my second book that are in paperback but the, the third and fourth book are Kindle books but you can also get my first and second book in Kindle so I thought I'd do a video about this to uh, let people know who are buying dating books that if you do buy a date book, dating book make sure it's, you're buying it by somebody who's actually writing the true stories and genuinely giving you you know uh, tips and 
how he handled a lot of women and so forth, like I do. But, but you know, there's no taking away from it that uh, these professional writers, they're good. And I got to say, this cover is really good. You know, I wish I could get a cover like this on my book. In fact, what I'll do, I'll, I'll uh, send this clip to my publisher and uh, they see if he wants me to do a, a fifth book or maybe he'll put this cover or something like this on one of my books because this is what sells, you see, beautiful women. This is what sells. Anyway, I'll end now and put this on YouTube, okay? Okay, I gotta film this uh, on my TV. It's Playboy TV chat. And um, I find it hard to believe that uh, these are asking for 150 yes one pound fifty a minute to chat to these pretty young women because as you can see it's an all nine number yeah but the point is they're advertising a beautiful woman on here but it doesn't mean that you'll be chatting to one anyway because you'll only hear the woman's voice or well, they might show a beautiful woman on there, you know. This is a catch-22 situation where they get men to phone up and men who are, have got to be very wealthy to be able to do this and they got to be uh, very lonely and desperate. But there must be men out there who do it, otherwise they would not be advertising this they wouldn't be able to afford to run this channel so they've got to have a lot of men who are willing to phone and pay 150 a minute just to chat with these women and yet there's no need for it because there's so many free dating sites out there where you can get plenty of women and genuine women who will chat to you and be willing to meet you now, you've only got to look at the rest of my videos to see this, and I've also got books out about it. Because if you Google me, Clive Worth, you'll see that I've had over a thousand women on the internet. And you that's over a ten year span dating on the, on the internet. And I, I'm not that handsome or good looking, I'm not that wealthy. But I'm on several free internet dating sites and I chat a lot to women from morning to night. I'm logging on and chatting to women all the time because I love doing it because I get a lot of dates from it and I don't have to pay 150 a minute. So, you know, all I can say the men who are paying this are absolutely crazy, desperate and wealthy. And I suppose they're very lonely as well and they get up in the morning and they see a beautiful blonde like this and they just have the urge to chat with it or not only in the morning in the night as well because this runs all night anyway um she is a good looking woman i admit you know uh, but of course a lot of these men probably think they could get her in bed with them uh, but <laughs> i i think that would cost you a lot more money if that happened and I suppose at the end of the day that's what they aim for but these are women just wanted to chat to get your money for chatting and a lot of men probably fall for it anyway I'll put this on YouTube now and see what you think of it uh, in the meantime have a look at the rest of my videos and you'll see how I managed to have over a thousand women on the internet and not pay a single penny